In the Update 8 version of Energy Simulator, green roofs have been added as a material so that it is possible to create green roof constructions on the energy model. So I have here a three-story office building with a standard slate roof. I'm going to create a new roof construction using plant material and about 6 inches or 150 millimeters of soil, similar to the construction shown in this diagram. I'll start by opening the Materials Manager, where I manage all the materials and constructions for the building. Let's start by looking at the current roof construction for the model. This is a fairly standard roof construction with rigid insulation and slate tiles. I'm going to copy this construction and then modify it. So I'll right click and select Copy Construction. I'll rename the new construction. I can now change the material layers of the new construction. I'll select the slate layer, select Change Layer. Now I can select a new material. I'll scroll down to the Vegetation category and select one of the vegetation layers. I'll select Thick Soil. I'll set the thickness of the soil to 150 millimeters. Now let's look at some of the other properties of this vegetation material. Note that it includes properties of plant height, leaf reflectivity, and the leaf area index, which can all be modified to customize the material. I'll select Apply, and then OK. Now I just need to apply the new roof construction to the building. I'll select Global Changes, then select all the rooms on Floor 2, these would be the rooms that have a roof surface. Then change the roof type to the new green roof construction. Select Apply, and all the rooms with a roof surface are changed to use the new green roof. If you found this video helpful, please give it a like. If you want to see more such series, consider subscribing to our channel. Thank you, and see you next time.